Hey, I decided to do a random live stream again. Thanks everybody who's already here. I know this was short notice. Sorry to you people in the UK who may be asleep or other parts of Europe, but you can watch this on the replay. So I am back here in the basement, gonna show you some trains that we have picked up recently. Got some Take and Play and some new Thomas Adventures. And I decided not to buy the new Trackmaster sets or the new Thomas Adventures um, Sea Creature, Sea Monster set. Just not going to buy those right now. I will wait till they go on clearance. But um, we're going to show you some of the things I got um, recently. I think I might have mentioned this in a previous video. I went to a YouTube thing. Uh, it's like a creator type day. And I got my little badge. I'm going to start wearing this when I go to Walmart. It says, Joseph Olson, Trains Are Fun, YouTube. <laughs> I like sharks. This brings our shark. This trains are. I found him. This trains are wooden. All right, this is the bag. This is from Toys R Us and Tuesday morning. Tuesday morning is a store. So before we get to that, let me acknowledge a few of you here in the chat. We got Pro Knight 2044, Nicholas White, Jim Brims Mead. Matt the Gamer Train, Minecraft Train Gaming, Julia May, hey, Tra Thomas the Train, Kenny3901, Trains for Life, Lego Freak, as always, everybody, help Lego Freak, go subscribe to his channel, he always helps me with these live streams, I want to thank him for that, and I'll also, um, before I get to mentioning some of you, I try to mention everybody in the chat, but I can't, I don't always get to everybody, and if I don't say your name, don't ask for a shout out because you might get blocked or you know, put in timeout or something. Hey, Max and Monty, 15 and 16, Oliver, the West Western Engine, Wooden Amtrak Productions, WAP, hey, Nate JW, hey, Jazzy Animations, Trainboy 13, Tar Tanker Video, hi, Tyson Robertson, Nathan Pratt, Roblox Master, and Gaming Lego Master 123, Mad Attack with a lot of T's. Ryan Rocket with a Z. Thomas the Tank Engine number one. He says, I'm playing Minecraft, but I'll be back when this is done. That's cool. Awesome Train 77, Piston Cup Productions. Hi, Gael. And we got Trains for Life. Did I say that? Jackie Kusak. I think I show blasters too. Henry the Green Engine number three. Train 4472. That's the Flying Scotsman. Do Bear 320, Tyson Robinson. Couch Potato 810 Gaming. That's what we do when we play games. We're couch potatoes. Yep. Ozzy Deshapel. I can never say your name right. But um, Merlin and Murdoch Fan 1997. Me Ups Awesome Productions. Wait. Me Appius. I cannot say your name. Sorry. Spencer Brownwig. Hey. All right. So let's we'll get back to the chat in a minute. So let's go Elsa's Boyfriend. <laughs> Fox Bug, one six five 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 three eight three eight. Hey, I've been pretty good. And Christian Lippert too. He was over there on the other live stream as well. Ryan Nepal, and I think I've caught up. Warren Dieter Shorn. Hey, all right. So, um, all right. So I'm going to stop with that. Uh oh, hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh, how do you stop this? Dang it. <laughs> You're faster than me, Lego freak. <laughs> Way to go. <laughs> Intercity 83. Tonight on Trains Are, the audience will have a mild conversation and claims the lives of audience members as we compare old and new toys of the same franchise. That was an excellent intro. Thank you, Intercity 83. I love it. I hope I said it with the right voice. So, uh, basically, at Tuesday morning, they had all, almost all of the different talking Thomas engines. I already have them, so I didn't get them. They had Ferdinand, James, Diesel, Thomas, Percy, all the taking plays that talk. But since I already had all of them, I didn't pick them up. Um, but I did pick up these two taking plays because I couldn't remember if I had them. One of you will probably know <laughs> if I already had them. So we picked up um, Bert the Miniature Engine, and I picked up Sir Handel. And every every time I see Sir Handel, I think of Handel's Messiah. <laughs> I 
All right. Hey, what an Amtrak production. Can you say, can I do some more G-Scale? G-Scale is a lot bigger than this, isn't it? Yeah, and I do want to do more of that. Uh, right now, the, the problem with the G-Scale is space. I don't have the space to set it up, but hopefully we can do that. But So should I open these? All right. Vote. Should I open? Should I open? Never mind. Never mind. I'm not going to give you all a chance to answer. Sorry. Oh, my video is playing in the background. That's going to miss my thing up there. All right. Yeah. Already got some yeses in there. Train five. Train Flying Scotsman said yes. I should open it. Open them, says Nicholas White. All over the West Western. And he has the Rex, Mike, and Burke. See, I knew I had some of the miniature engines, but I can never remember which ones I have. I think I have Burt, but we'll have to do another collection video so I can go through and see which ones I actually have. So this is the Take and Play Sir Handle. Nothing new. So they're clearing them out. If you live in the USA, it's a store called Tuesday Morning. I used to think that they were only opened on Tuesday, but they're open all the time. <laughs> but you can ask your parents to go there. Yeah. <laughs> Lego Freak is super fast. <laughs> and uh, that's where you can get these really good price. Um, they're a lot cheaper than the new Thomas Adventures, and you can get all the talking ones, per perhaps. Perhaps. All right, so, um, yeah. Okay, then I went to Toys R Us, and I picked up Hugo. Toys R Us has a lot of the wooden railway stuff on sale, as does Fisher-Price, Mattel website. Um, so I'm getting them pretty cheap, or a lot cheaper than they were normally. So I picked up Hugo. I know I had the uh, t taken or the um, Thomas Adventures version already. All right, so now let's get to the Thomas. Actually, let's go ahead and open this. Extraordinary engines, here we go. And they mixed up. They had the uh, Thomas Adventures in the same rack as the Wooden Railway version there. So that's the Toys R Us. And then the rest of these were also from Toys R Us. What did we get? All right. Oh, that's an empty. All right, I got Stephen the Rocket. That's pretty good. Yeah, Undead Evie, they killed, they killed Wooden Railway. I hear it's going to be called Thomas Wood, I, and I think it's going to be squashed. I know a lot of people complain with uh, some of the new uh, Thomas Adventures that they're actually shrunk, they're squashed. And um, I think that's going to be the same thing with the Thomas Wood. Um, but I haven't really seen many of them. But now I got the Steven, which basically I think what they've done on some of the adventures is they've basically just taken the magnets off and put them on new ones. <laughs> All right. So these are two. The other two here. These are re-releases of previous Take and Play sets. You got the Sodor Celebration. So we have this in the take and play version, and this is one of my favorite, the cleanup crew. It's got the garbage Percy and Scruff and the cargo car and one of my favorite characters with. So that's pretty awesome. So we had the, um, we already had the take and play versions of these, which I bought on the aftermarket because they weren't in stores when I started collecting these. So I like, yeah, yeah they feel metal. This is one of my favorite. Whiff with the garbage recycling. I love Whiff. And if you don't know, I know some of you might not be interested in this, but I actually, I literally was in dumpsters when I was a teenager. <laughs> I worked at a theme park here in Georgia called Six Flags Over Georgia. I've done quite a few videos on my other channels talking about that. Um, but I literally would get in dumpsters sometimes. <laughs> It's part of my job. It's sad. I know. <laughs> so I'm always partial to sets that have garbage on them. Like, and here's another one of my favorite characters, Percy, and he's covered in garbage. So that's pretty amazing. And then, of course, Scruff with the garbage. So that was, this is one of my all-time favorite Take and Play and now Thomas Adventure sets, mainly because it's got two of my favorite characters and it's got garbage. Is that weird? Am I weird? Tell me if I'm weird. This probably is weird. All right. Another thing we like to collect, and we just did a not too long ago Annie and Clarabelle collection. So there's Clarabelle, and there's Annie. 
you switch them this way. There's Annie. There's Clarabelle. And it's the celebration versions. And now we can we can put Annie and Clarabelle on the wrong way now and affect all the OCD kids in the world. I'm sorry, kids. We can we can set this up totally wrong and everybody gets upset. Oh no! Clarabelle's going the wrong way. Annie's facing the right way. Oh, let's turn Annie. Let's, let's do it this way. Now they're totally wrong. <laughs> Clarabelle is now Annie, and Annie is now Clarabelle. All over the world, kids are getting upset. That's what I like to do, kids. I like to mix things up on you. So uh, that's what I picked up. Um, I love that you can mix and match things with the uh, Thomas Adventures. I am actually pleased with Thomas Adventures. I know some people might be like, what? But I love that you connect it to uh, Trackmaster and to the Thomas Mini. So I think it's a good good thing they've done. And I'm looking forward to seeing what the Thomas Wood sets look like. But I don't know if I'm going to like them. And this right here is probably exactly the same as the Take and Play version. I'll not be able to tell them apart. And I have to get you guys to help me. So let's get the back over here. Hopefully Lego Freak, y'all were kind to him. Hey, Jeff Brinsmead says it's his first live stream. Thank you so much for finding the channel. Elsa's boyfriend says, Arp, rip Thomas Wooden Railway. Rip it. Oh, <laughs> I think my live stream just... Hold on, my chat's kind of frozen. Oh, boy. Let's close that window. This is what happens. Restore chat. My computer has froze. I'm turning all that off. Now I'm going to have to look at the chat on my phone. All right. Microphone is fading. It could be my internet. Does this sound better? I'll have to wait five seconds to see y'all. All right. Hopefully the stream is still going. All over the West Western Engine. I just saw your comment. I saw Ryan... Ru Ryan Rockets, tra Train 4472 Flying Scotsman. What happened to the worried and happy face that Annie and Claire built? I don't know. Okay, Lego Freak says yes. Nicholas White says yes a little better. Could have been my t-shirt. Thomas and Birdie Studios. Hi. All right. Thank you for letting me know that's a little better. Laughing Truck Media. <laughs> it's a troublesome truck there. Merlin and Murdoch fan says yes. Back. Okay. We're good. All right. The stream is still on, Choo Choo. That's right. Choo Choo Guard the Lion. <laughs> All right, Thomas the Train. Uh, be careful. <laughs> Undead Evie. Does Whiff not have his glasses? You know, that's actually kind of what I was thinking. They're hard to see. But when I first took them out, I thought that. Then I don't know if I can focus with the... Um, when I'm on a live stream, it's hard to zoom in. But he does appear to have the glasses, but they're so faint. They almost look like um, somebody punched them in the eye or something. I don't know. Felisa Hav. <laughs> Aiden Meehan. Hey. Oh, <laughs> South Carolina. Yeah. Thank you, Thomas and Birdie Studios, John Franco, Martin. The adventures connect to Ertl. Oh, that's a good point. You know, I actually haven't tried to do that. Um, but uh, those Ertl connectors, it seems like, yeah, they could connect. I don't have an Ertl handy with me right here. I would do that. I, okay, I want to ask y'all a question. So... Of everything that I do, I think the most popular things that I do are related to the HO scale trains or the OO scale, the Hornby trains, the Botman trains. Uh, but outside of that, outside of the, the model railway, I do want to expand my railway, make it bigger. But what's the next type of um, that you like is, you know, we got wooden railway, we got take and play, which we'll mix in with Thomas Adventures. You know, we got Tommy. And Trackmaster and Ertl and any other discontinued themes. Of those, okay, Felisa says wooden, wooden. Dylan says wooden. 
Oh, yeah, I, I forgot the minis. Nicholas White said the minis. You know, I like the minis. They're very collectible. Um, but it's, it's kind of hard to keep up with them. They make so many of them. Thomas Wooden Railway. Dylan says Wooded. Wooden Railway, Minecraft says. Tomies by the Flying Scotsman. Wooden, wood. So it looks like most people are saying wooden. I have totally neglected doing wooden railway videos. I was wondering, because personally, I tell you, my, what my favorite would be, outside of all those, would be the Trackmaster and Tommy. Uh, and doing more videos with those, but I'm surprised there's so many people that like uh, wooden. I'm well, I'm not surprised because it's a high quality product and a lot of playability with it. Um, I like the ease of the play with the Trackmaster, how you can, you know, they're, they're motorized and they go fast and you can do stuff with them and stuff. But uh, that's why I like Trackmaster and Tommy. I am still partial to the Blue Track era of that. So we may be doing some more videos. I was trying to think of like focusing like each month, focus on one subset of the Thomas uh, theme. Like one month we're going to do wooden railway sets because what happens is, uh, I have to keep everything, hold on a minute, because everybody only has finite space. So like all the wooden railway stuff is right here. Well, it's not all of it. It's, there's another thing there. And then and then I have like Trackmaster in different boxes. Like oh, all the Trackmaster engines are on this side of the table. And then there's Trackmaster track in there. And I got another box. There's the old original Tommy stuff. Original Tommy. And then... Like over here is different boxes have Ertl taking play. Um, there's even some wooden railway stuff still there. And then the Thomas Minis are on a whole other side of the basement, or not another side of the basement, but on another shelf. Thomas Minis are down here. And then all this is Mega Blocks, which I totally left out in this discussion, but I knew people probably didn't like Thomas Mega Blocks as much as the other stuff. It's Lego train track. <laughs> Right. Oh, look at that! Have y'all seen this? Ninjago City. My son's been building this. He's only got these few bags left. This is a really cool set. It's a sushi bar. <laughs> it's such a cool set. I'll have He'll have to do a video when he gets done with that. But it's a really awesome, awesome set. All right, I'm going to come back over here and we'll wrap this up before I go. I got to say hi to everybody again. So what we're going to do is we're almost we're 18 minutes, which is plenty long enough for the stream. I want to thank everybody who is in the stream, who's watching it while we're live now. And if you're watching it on the replay, be sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification. And if you're new to my chats, the best way to not get a shout out is to ask for a shout out. The best way to get a shout out is to just get in the discussion about questions I ask or what people are talking about in the chat or do a super chat. But anyway, let's get to who's here now. So if you want me to say your name, this is the time to do it. Ethan Westergaard, Thomas and Birdie Studios, Trains for Life, Belisa Hove, Angel Toy Games and Reviews, Thomas Fan 2004, Dylan Heffern. Oh, so delete that, please. I don't have my, <laughs> hold on a minute. Oh, this is so annoying. <laughs> All right, back to, back to the normal people. <laughs> Thomas Fan 2004, Thomas and Birdie Studios, Train 4472, Flying Scotsman, Trick <laughs> Kristen Parker, <laughs> Elsa's boyfriend, Kristen Lefford, Thomas the Blue, E2 Class 2006. Come up with some shorter names. These are hard to say. I like names like, uh, I'm just messing with you guys, JLR. I like that. Minecraft Train Gamer 17. Twilight, Twilight Sparkle. That's easy to say. Merlin and Murdoch Fan 1997 is easy to say, but this is kind of long. I'm not being critical. I'm sorry. I, I, don't, I don't want to be critical of people's channel names, uh, but they are hard to say sometimes. Choo Choo. That one's easy to say. Undead Evie. Easy to say. Trains for Life. Easy to say. <laughs> Lisa Hoff. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. Jags Martin. <laughs> the set that caused the year in blackout. <laughs> the new storytellers. He says he likes seeing the model trains. And I think that will still be the main feature of the channel. 
will be the model train. Oh, guess what I got? Guess, oh, oh, I don't have it. But we got another Hornby coming very soon. Can you guess what it is? I'm not going to tell you, but uh, we got another Hornby uh, locomotive coming. Jonathan Franco Martin says Ringo Starr or George Carlin. Caveman or Rufus? <laughs> Do y'all know which one is Caveman? Do you know which one is Rufus? <laughs> I like both of those. I like um, I like Ringo Starr uh, as uh, the narrator because he's British <laughs> and he's one of the he's original, right? I like George Carlin because he is funny and he is animated and I like how he can change his voices. And he was Rufus. So, Rufus. <laughs> so it, I guess it depends on where you live, but um, uh, the, I am partial to the original episodes. Lego Freak says he liked Alec Baldwin. Alec Baldwin does have some redeeming value as a narrator for Thomas and Friends, but Oh my God, the um, I'm still in um, I'm still suffering from seeing Thomas and the Magic Railway, so I apologize. <laughs> All right, Show Blaster Two likes Horn. It's not Hornby Burt, but that was a good guess, excellent guess because I don't have Hornby Burt, and that's what Trains for Life said as well. Um, Jalen Williams did not say anything except what I don't want people to say. <laughs> <laughs> you can call me Chris. All right, Christian, I'll try to remember that in future. You're, you've been on a lot of these. I need to try to remember that. Choo Choo says Hornby Diesel. No, I bid on Hornby Diesel and somebody outbid me at the last minute. I was like, oh. So it's not Duncan either. That's what Train 4470 Flying Scotsman said. Stanley, don't forget, you see, uh, <laughs> Train Boy 13. Yes, Jeff. That's it. So y'all, I said I wasn't going to say it. <laughs> but I won't say it in the video. So that way, if you're watching it on uh, replay, you won't know. But those in the chat, Jeff Brins Mead is that's what I'm getting. So y'all will be in the know. People that are watching this live, yes, Choo Choo, that's right. That's what it is. See, and if you're watching this on replay, you're going to like, what's he talking about? What's he talking about? But you guys and gals, you know what's coming. Yes, that's right, Show Blaster <laughs> and Flying Scotsman. Yes, that is it. And so I'm really super excited for that to be coming. So we'll, I want to do a comparison of all of the botman characters we have with the counterparts that Hornby made. So we'll be doing something with that coming up. And I really appreciate everybody being here and being super cool to each other. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah we're about to go as soon as you get here Ruffle, I said, there's ruffle the rock rough i said he's he's here and i gotta leave now no i'm just kidding no we're, we're about to end it so um yeah we're really super excited um about this and we will be showing you that in an upcoming video so i'm not did i say it in this video did i say the word <laughs> i hope i didn't say it all of you guys were right i probably said it didn't mean to. But thanks, guys and gals. And stay tuned. I don't know when it's going to get here because it's coming from the UK. It could be here next week. It could be here next month. I don't know. I'm still waiting. I ordered Rosie, the Play Rail Rosie. I ordered it over a month ago, and I still haven't got it. So, But that's coming from Japan. Anyway, thanks a lot, and you guys are awesome. And as I said in my Brickzar video I did today, be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes.